Good morning, Arizona. It is 813. Coming up next on a Friday night, most people want to get out of the kitchen. Maybe go on a little date, go have dinner. Well, guess what? There's a cooking class in Scottsdale that makes the kitchen a fun place to be on a Friday night where you not only learn how to cook up a great meal, you can cook up a little romance, too. I feel like crying. This is the I best know. time. It's making me cry seeing you in the kitchen. <laughs> I gotta tell you, Tony's been roped into a lot of things this fall by his wife, Olivia. She takes her husband on assignment to see if a couple's cooking class is the place for them. Welcome back, everyone. If you are tired of the same old dinner and a video on Friday night, Olivia has a great suggestion. Good morning. <laughs> Good morning, Tara. Yes, you mentioned that I have roped my husband into quite a few activities recently, but this one he was all for because I have revealed to you I am a wreck in the kitchen. This is a great idea, spending a little time cooking, maybe learning a thing or two. Hi, hey, buddy. Nice to meet you. Wife, Andrew. Hi, Andrew. Nice yeah. to meet you. Are you guys good cooks already? Tony, it's so nice to meet you. The kitchen is open and the students are mingling at Scottsdale's Classic Cooking. This Friday night class is for couples, so kisses can even be thought of as a key ingredient, along with the wine that's served while you cook. It's a perfect spot for newlyweds, but Chef Pascal Dionneau's kitchen is uncharted ground to me, and I guess that's the point. I'm gonna talk to you about the menu. A red currant glazed pork tenderloin with red cabbage. I made that last night. Yes, yes. What we're, is we're going to do a puff pastry base. We're gonna blind bake. Then we like caramelize some onion. So you really enjoy this, right? We really enjoy it. Yeah, oh, we cook all the time. My husband and I both do. Olivia, you want to get in here and do this for a little All while? right. You see, Chef Pascal may explain the dishes, but he doesn't cook them. Students are assigned a course. Andrea, Steve, Tony, and I are on caramelized onion duty, the heart and soul of that savory puff pastry starter. We're going to spread the onion on top of the puff pastry, sprinkle some smoked cheese, and then flash it in the oven before serving it. destroyed a dinner or had too much wine or anything in the process no. to sabotage the meal here? Not really, not really. And uh, uh, I'm hanging around the whole thing. Ah, okay. And uh, my assistant Katrina also is there with me. And we, uh, if anything happened, and it, it has happened that people said, well, I'm done, I really am not in the mood to finish it. So we just jump in and finish it. Okay. The kitchen here is often filled with kids. Classic Cooking offers a popular program for young chefs. But Pascal doesn't run the kitchen on those days. He may wish he took tonight off, too. I'm very much a perfectionist, and uh, just watching them fumble with a knife or not using the right technique, uh -oh. just, just, I'd rather look the other way. Uh, I'm going to warn you right now, do not look in my direction at all tonight. That's okay. <laughs> I, I, at least I can uh, maybe teach you a little something. Okay, we'll see. Good luck to you. My Sicilian grandmother said that all men should know how to cook. It's obviously paid off because my wife likes it. And we all like celebrating the fruits, or shall we say tenderloins, of our efforts. It's compliments to the chefs all the way around. Well, we just finished our first couple's cooking class, and we learned a few things, and we met some great people. And we had a great meal. So overall, it was a success. It was. And a romantic night. Yes, Thanks it was. Thanks for coming, hubby. Let's Thank go you, home. Thank you, sweetie. Let's go. Okay. Not so fast. Oh, what? Not so fast. Somebody needs to do the dishes. Chef! Right this way. Just like home. Way to go, hubby. Oh. <laughs> After all that hard work, I just couldn't bring myself to do the dishes, but we had a great time, and I think I picked up some basics about chopping. I don't think I could pull off that three-course meal just yet, but we can always go for another class, Tara. It goes on uh, throughout the year, and they'll, they'll post the menus on their website. We've got all the information on azfamily.com if you're interested. All right, so I just want to get the line down right. Way to go, hubby, is how you say it when he gets the dishes and then he takes off. <laughs> yeah. Way to go, Abby. It rolls off the tongue. Try it at oh. home. I promise sometimes it works. Oh, I've tried it. It doesn't work for me. <laughs>